pretty heavy, actually. <laughs> There's, there definitely is a ball in here, right? For sure. Oh, there we go. Got it. Perfect. Thanks. Cool. All right. So, what would I do as your caddy right now? I just kind of liked my caddy to retrieve the balls, so I just kind of putt the holes and they throw them back. So I'm like a dog. Basically, yeah. You played with Tiger during his highest professional round. <laughs> yeah. Have you ever thought of calling it the Zach Blair effect? <laughs> I think that'd uh, be good. Obviously, after that, I must be kind of an intimidating force around the uh, golfing world. <laughs> what do you think you, it is that you did in that round that was so intimidating? <laughs> Ah, uh, nothing. I mean, you know, he was just kind of catching some rough breaks more than anything. Right. So, if you were going to psych somebody out, could you try to psych me out right now? <sighs> I doubt it. <laughs> How many times would you say you hit a shot and you just think, There it is. Oh my god, that is just <laughs> perfect. You know? Um, you know, not too often. Oh my Definitely, it was nice to hit that one at Sony when it really mattered. You know, right. kind of hit the best shot I've ever hit. So it was the best shot you've ever hit. I mean, I, I don't, you can't hit it any better. Why don't players talk about their shots more? Like, why was everyone so excited about that? Like to me, it seemed like I do that all the time. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I guess just because it was on TV, obviously helped. Right. I've always been a pretty vocal player um, with my friends and everything at home. You know, we always kind of make jokes and talk to our balls and stuff like that. So it was kind of nice to get get one on camera. Do you not like when other people talk to your ball? I, okay I could care that? less. Yeah. No rules. No rule for me. Oh, that one needs some help. Yes, in for a four. <laughs>